Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel and in this video we are going to resolve this annoying error and the error number is 8009016 which says trusted platform module has malfunctioned. So this is a very simple and straightforward process. So let's get started. So what you can do is simply just go to the start menu and right here control panel and from control panel just change the category to large icons so that we can see each individual icons, not in the category, but the individual functions. And then I'll select this credentials manager and select the windows credentials. So if you see any kind of credentials like Microsoft office, just simply select that right now I'm showing the example on some other credentials. You will do it if you see the Microsoft office only. So just select that and click on remove. So it will ask you for the confirmation. You can select yes. And then I'll just go to the start menu and write here file explorer options. I'll select the options, not the file explorer itself. So let's click here and then I'll simply go to the view tab and select show hidden files, folders and drives. Click apply and click OK. And now I'll go to the start menu again right here, file explorer. And from here, I'll go to this PC, go to C and you can see all the hidden folders shown right here. I'll go to the users. And double click on the user account name that you have for a personal computer. Here I have Saad and yours will be different. So click here and then I'll go to the app data folder and then I'll go to local and find the folder which says packages. So here is the packages folder. Make sure that it's only showing packages here and not packages cache. So just double click here and I'll search for here Microsoft AAD, something like that. And since I don't have this problem, so it's not showing right here. Otherwise, what you can do is just simply select that folder which says Microsoft AAD and it will also say with that broken plugin, as you can see in the screenshot. So just delete that. And once that's deleted, you can just simply restart your PC. And after that, just go to the start menu and remember to change the file explorer options to don't view or don't show the hidden files and folders. Why? Because these are very important files that you shouldn't mess with. So let's click OK and don't show that icons. And afterwards, just finally restart your PC. And after restarting, it should solve the problem. So that's it, guys. I hope you liked the video. And if you did, subscribe to our channel and comment down below if this method works for you. And I will see you in the next one.